With all these supernatural discoveries that have come out recently, it really makes me believe that God is trying to get our attention. I've been a Christian for a couple of years, but in my few years of coming to Christ, I have not seen so much different supernatural phenomena being proven by science in just the past month, which leads me to believe that something big is occurring in the supernatural realm. What's going on guys? It's Big Nick back for another video. Thank you guys so much for coming back to the channel today. Before we get into today's video, if you guys like Christian content, please give this video a like, subscribe to my channel down below if you are new, and turn on my post notifications so you never miss a new video. Without further ado, let's get into it. Scientists just discovered biblically accurate angels and what they found will shock you. A newly released study by the Royal Astronomical Society shows documented evidence of a strange phenomena known as Dyson spheres, where they were able to detect intelligent life harnessing energy around home stars. When they released the official footage, the form in which this intelligent life was displayed shocked many. But the reason why this was so mind-blowing is because this looks exactly how the Bible describes a class of angelic beings known as the Ophanum. Now before I show you the comparisons, let's take a look at the official news report together so you can see how significant this really is. A group of researchers say they've identified at least seven stars that might be surrounded by super advanced alien megastructures known as di and spheres. Yes, I said alien structures and I know what you're thinking, but just stay with me here because the basic idea was this. Superior intelligent life might build big structures around their home stars or planets as a way to harness or reuse that energy. A 1960s physicist who came up with this idea, Freeman Dyson, argued that if these structures existed, there'd be so much energy that human scientists on Earth could probably spot it because it would emit a lot of infrared radiation. So in this new study, researchers say they found seven sources glowing in the infrared, those are their words, but couldn't find an obvious explanation for why these sources are glowing so much, which could mean they're Dyson spheres or something else entirely. This is merely identical to the biblical description of the Ophanim that the prophet Ezekiel saw in his vision. In Ezekiel 1 15 to 21, the prophet Ezekiel details about an encounter he had with an angel, and he describes their appearance as wheels intersecting wheels, with the rims around them all covered with eyes. In the scripture, it says this, Now as I looked at the living creatures, I saw a wheel on the earth besides the living creatures, one for each of the four of them. As for the appearance of the wheels and their construction, their appearance was like the gleaming of beryl, and the four had the same likeness, their appearance and construction being as it were a wheel within a wheel. When they went, they went in any of their four directions without turning as they went. And their rims were tall and awesome. And the rims of all four were full of eyes all around. And when the living creatures went, the wheels went beside them. And when the living creatures rose from the earth, the wheels rose. Wherever the spirit wanted to go, they went. And the wheels rose along with them. For the spirit of the living creatures was in the wheels. When those went, these went. And when those stood, these stood. And when those rose from the earth, the wheels rose along with them. For the spirit of the living creatures was in the wheels. Now take a look at what that biblical description of the Ophanim angel looks like, and soon you'll see it's exactly identical to the Dyson spheres that the scientists discovered and claim was a form of intelligent life. Scientists unknowingly prove biblically accurate angels to be real, and this is not an extraterrestrial phenomena like they think, but actually an interdimensional being that the Bible spoke about thousands of years ago. Science does not disprove Christianity, but instead validates it because the closer you get to truth, the closer you get to God. Everything is being revealed in this hour because these discoveries are a call to action from God himself to return back to him before it's too late. Seek forgiveness of your sin and ask God to cleanse you because now is the time to surrender to Jesus Christ. Like I said in the beginning, I have never seen this much supernatural phenomena being discovered and validating the Bible as I've seen in the past month. God is doing something. I don't know what it is, but the only thing I can think of is he's trying to warn people that his word is true and people really need to repent and they need to turn away from living for the world because this world has nothing to offer and in the end, it captures your eternal soul and leads it to destruction forever. I want to thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you believe in the word of God, I want you to comment down below. The Bible never misses. If you guys want to financially sow into this ministry, I have an offering link that's in the description where you can sow into the ministry one time or become a monthly partner. Also, if you want another way to support, I have merch that I also drop, which is linked in the description as well. And I want to thank all of you guys who have ordered that merch too. It really means a lot. But if you don't like clothes, you can also be a member on the channel as well. I have perks now that are integrated with becoming a channel member here, such as early access to certain videos, as well as many other perks. So check out the membership opportunity that I have here on the channel as well. Also, guys, I just dropped a new song a couple days ago called Yahweh Colin. So make sure to check that out. That is also in the description as well. I'll see you guys very soon for another video. I love you guys so much. May God bless all of you. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, take care and peace out.